Hello everybody and welcome to the Magic Studio for another episode of Bungle Collects. Got a 50p coin hunt for you. We're going to be looking for the commemorative coins, the ones that have got pictures on and the ones that are worth more than 50p that's stamped on them and we would love to fill our album. We have been cracking on this Lady M since you were in short trousers. Um, I don't know what the equivalent is, equivalent is for a woman so I just went with short trousers, sorry about that. Um, Anyway, it was just the cut of my jib. So uh, we need Kew Gardens, and we still need Olympic football, which we'd never, ever found in a coin hunt, and uh, and hockey. And we have everything else, including some lovely coins. I mean, the put I love this page in particular with a Jemima puddle duck and a squirrel nookin and a, uh, an Isaac Newton. Absolutely, absolutely fantastic. And this page with Flopsies and Peter Rabbits. Found tons of them, but not uh, and some oddities and foreign coins in the back, but not them three that we're looking for. So let's see whether... Post Office and Birmingham Cash Centre from Track 1, done on the 25th of March 2021, is going to bring us some luck. Lady M do the biz. So these are lovely to open these, aren't they? The uh, Post Office bags tears in, you just rip them open, they just open like butter. They are superb. Right, any commemorative coins that we find, and this will be one, and we're starting off with a, with a diversity, half of the Brexit set from 2020. Any coins we find go on the mat, and the rarest ones are at the top, the gold finds, Scouts. and the uh, and the, the not-so-rare ones are go on the, on the bottom. So Scouts is there, 7,710,000. Paddington at the tower. And we rank them in gold, silver, and bronze, or, or no colour at all. And that Paddington at the tower will also be a no colour. That Brexit I found was a was a silver find as far as we are concerned. Ooh. Dictionaries. Got a nice one. This is certainly the plum. This will be the, the best coin of the of the hunt so far. And it'll take a little bit of beating. The di di uh, dictionaries oh, down there, yeah. Um NHS, so this is a silver find. Uh oh. Oh no, it's not. I meant it's only bronze. NHS, I like that one. You like it as well, don't mm -hmm. you? Five million and one thousand from nineteen ninety eight. Only a bronze find. I suppose it could be an honorary silver find because it goes back to 1998. So there's less and less of them in circulation. It becomes a little bit more scarce. Um, so honorary silver for that one. And because it's one of Lady M's favourite coins ever. He's a Benjamin Money. He is not scarce. There's 25 million of him in circulation. We do have to check for edge inscriptions because Coin Patrol writes Coin Patrol now. Stamps Coin Patrol on the edge in one millimetre writing. You can also check for rotation errors on these and you're looking to see if anybody signed one. Um, and wow. Yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's a Roger Bannister. A flipper neck. It's not a great neck, that is it? Mm -hmm. So Benjamin, make out what it was. Benjamin Buddies, uh, we always have a little guess about how many we think we're going to find. It's like a little mini competition and I think we're going to find eight and that is a nine millions worth of eight. people act yet. Okay. I'm saying eight. Oh, you absolute uh, wuss. <laughs> you know what I mean? Just splitting the difference. There's a rare for try inside. And straight after is a tail of Peter Rabbit. So have you gone for, because it was influenced by me doing eight? Did you think, wow, he's just gone for a crazy figure there. No. I'll split the difference. No. Honestly, you'll do anything to win you. Mm -hmm. Anything to win. Yes, there is another one. Nice one, old Benji. There's two of the eight that are going to... Absolutely flying with a bit of luck, anyway. There's libraries, little mini set with dictionaries because it's all kind of booky and wordy. Not valuable, I'm afraid. Uh, 11 million 263,000 of them in circulation. Oh, 2018. This would be nice. It's in lovely condition as well. If this is a, a Peter Rabbit or a Flopsy, we're laughing. Oh, it's people. I tell you what, it's in nice nick though. That's very, very shiny. Doesn't look like that's been in circulation Ooh, very long. Got a nice one in here. Ooh, got a nice one. Oh, it's Olympic. It's the Olympic uh, sunburst yeah. or starburst. Because I thought that that ball for vo in volleyball was the sun at one point. There is heroic acts. No, it's not. It's medals. There we go. So that is a silver find. It's in lovely condition. It is. Well. What's the uh, what's the the other side like? Yeah, it's coming. Nice. Not bad at all. 2011 Olympic. Certainly my favourite set and a lot of people's favourite set. Not an, Oli an Olympic that we need for the book, but absolutely a keeper. Did you see it found a Brexit? Oh no. No. 
No, it must have been the dad that feed from. Well, we found one in the in the hunt we just filmed, didn't we? In the two in the two pound hunt with a with, that we mixed, we did a mix up, didn't we? Yes. We had I come across a few bonus fifty pences when I was taking some uh, back to the bank. The lady in the till was kind enough to give me what she had in the till. So in the last two pound hunt, I did a. We did a, a little bonus, 50p on. Mm -hmm. Speaking of rabbits, there's one coming along. 2016 is very common, is, is old Peter. 9,700,000. Come on, The third bunny is on his way. Oh, Benji, you're my friend. And I hope to find at least seven others of you today. Do, 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 do. Another diversity. There's a smooth, another smooth one looking a little really worn away. Mm -hmm. it's, it's almost completely flat, that. It's been in circulation a while since 1997. With a Raphael, 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 is he a Raphael? Is he a Raphael David McClough? Oh, is he a, was he a Ninja Turtle? I can't remember. <laughs> There's Tiggy Winkle, Mrs. TW. Another one from the 2016 set. 8.8 .8 .8 million. She is just worth that 50 pence, unfortunately. That's another dictionaries. But she's worth a lot more to me, isn't she, Lady M? She is. She's a favourite of mine, Mrs. TW. It's a scandal she's only worth 50p. There's another People Act, 2018. There's a 2008 Britannia. So it's the lowest mintage of the Britannia at three and a half million. I've got a few. I don't keep any more. Well, I might keep that one now. I've found it. Worth about a quid. About a pound. And I'm sure at some point in the future it will increase in value. This one won't. Not until Lady M is long gone. Because it's nine million and one thousand. There's just so many in circulation. There's Tom Kitten. Three quarters of the 2017 Potter set. We've had into the tower. We just need Toad Boy to reach the uh, reach the full um, cohort. And there's another diversity. So we completed the Brexit set. Diversity and Brexit. I mean, diversity and Brexit. Three times. There's a slimy Tom Kitten. He's been a mucky, mucky boy, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. Where's he? Where's he been? I'm trying to think. He's been, I don't know, dredging becks, huh? climbing through bushes. He has dirty stuff out. There's a coin in here that's saying he had a rough life. Look at that. Look at that. That has been under a pool table. Uh, wedged in somewhere. Someone's absolutely hacked that to death. Why would somebody do that? Maybe for someone like me to find and then keep because it's a bit it's a bit of an oddity. Oh, there is Buddy. Nice one, Benji. Benji. My friend, there's the four. So we're going to find another four in the bag and a half we've got left. Mm -hmm. Looking forward to that. That's going to be some spectacular roar to victory, that. From the jaws of defeat. 
Let's hope we find one more and Lady M will bust. And I will then be designated the winner as the as the closest for someone who hasn't bust. <laughs> Come on, Benji. Do it for me, baby. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Do it for me, baby. Benji, Benji. That's another dictionary. That's no blooming good. Well, while you're going through that, uh, that, that last little stack, I uh, just want to ask everybody to please consider subscribing. So if you're not subscribed already, please do hit that subscribe button. Hit the, the like, the thumbs up. It lets us know you care. Leave us some comments. Follow us on social media. Everything's in the description below. And maybe send us something and write to us in the PO box as well if you want. Let's review what we've got. So Lady Emma's indeed won the, the Benjamin Bunny Challenge. And I'm afraid there's no wriggling out of that, uh, love. You've got <laughs> no. bang on four. Four it is. There's no... Uh, there's no getting away from it, so Rude. so well well done. Thank you. <laughs> right, uh, honourable mentions. I'm going to give an honourable mention to the Battle of Hastings and an honourable mention to the the Brexity set. We've completed three and a half times. The plum is definitely between uh, these two. Let's uh, let's have a little look. My thoughts are that it should be the NHS because we don't find the NHS very often, and we do find volleyball quite a lot considering. Um, I was going to give it in the condition. I thought, oh, but condition-wise, I can't really, I can't really turn that uh, volleyball down because it's in such good nick. However, when you turn it over, there is a little bit of a, there's a little bit of a blemish, or is it just because it's cold, it's just cold and then it's the uh, the sun is out in the yeah. magic studio today. So, so sweaty palms. Yeah, maybe. So I think we're probably. I think I'm going to have to give it to the volleyball just in sheer condition. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, although it's a close call because I do like their NHS and the fact that you like it means that I like it. It helps, you know, it, it helps me yeah. like it if you like it. No two ways about it. Okay, right. Well, we're all done. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you in the next episode.